What is up guys, Freeman Rat here, and welcome back to episode 2 of Neglected Nations, the series that is voted for by you. You guys get to choose the next squad I build, and at the end of the last episode, or just sort of during it, I asked whether you'd want me to build a Bulgarian side or a Bosnian side, and as you can see by the title of the video, Bulgaria was the one that got the most comments, um, was the, got the most votes in the comment section. Um, so, the same as last time. You guys get to vote now down in the description in the comment section for the next episode. There's a there's five different choices this time. Um, I shall leave the uh, five different nations, and you can either thumbs up the comment, the one I've posted, or you can vote yourself. So, would you rather me build a Canadian squad, a Chilean squad, a Colombian squad, a Croatian squad, or a Czech Republic squad? Go and vote now. Um, it only takes two seconds to vote. Give the video a thumbs up as well while you're there. It only takes two seconds. Anyway. So let's move on straight to this Bulgarian squad builder, and in goal we have Mihalov. There's going to be a lot of fucking up of the pronunciations on this uh, this squad builder, so I do apologise. Um, anyway, in goal we have Mihalov. We picked him up for 350 coins, six foot four, and to be honest, for a 77 rated um, keeper, he, you can't go wrong. 84 reflexes and 80 diving being his standout stats, and then uh, he's also got 78 handling and 75 kicking. All round, a really really decent card. Moving on to left back, we have Zanev. Um, we picked him up for 150 coins, so absolutely nothing. And all round, again, not, not a bad card, to be honest. Uh, 75 heading and 69 pace being his standout stats, but it also does have 65 defending, 60 dribbling, and 60 passing. Not too bad. Does help out the uh, the left mid as well. Moving on to right back, we have Bandolovsky. Uh, Ivan Bandolovsky, we bought him for 200 coins, one of my favourite players in this team. Standout stats being his 74 pace and his 70 dribbling, but it does also have 65 defending and 61 passing. Six foot, um, really does get down the wing. He's got a medium attacking work rate, high defensive work rate, so he does work up and down the right wing really, really well. And then moving on to the two centre-backs, we've got Nikolov and Ivanov. Ivanov, my favourite of the two, picked him up for 200 coins and his standout stats being his 78 heading and his 73 defending, but it does also have at 70 pace, which for a centre back, a silver centre back on uh, on FIFA 14 is really, really good. Six foot two, very, very strong, hardly ever gets muscled off the ball. Then moving on to Nikolov, we picked him up for 500 coins, four star weak foot, and his standout stats are his 66 defending and his 65 pace, but it does also have at 62 heading is there as well. Six, six foot three. Him and Ivanov really do work out very well. Moving on to right mid, one of the slowest players I've ever used on FIFA this year. We have Grigori Peeve. Picked him up for 400 coins. Now, his stats there look absolutely shocking, but he's a better card than he looks. He looks a lot, he's in game, he's a lot faster than 57 pace. His standout stats being his 72 shooting and his 69 passing, but it does also have 68 dribbling and 60 heading. He's more of a defensive winger. Even though it says he's got high attacking work rate, he's got a medium defensive work rate, which means he does help back a, a little bit. Um, and obviously, 57 pace isn't that great, but in game, he's got a nice cross on him, and uh, that's basically what we've used him for. He's quite old as well, born in 1979. I'm not going to work out the maths because I'll end up fucking myself up. Moving on to left mid, we have one of my, as well, one of my favourite players in this uh, team. We have Alexander Tonev, who plays for Villa. We bought him for 2,400 coins, 5-star weak foot, 3-star skill moves, and his standout stats being his 90 pace there. But he does also have 69 dribbling, 67 shooting, and 63 passing, which isn't too bad. Moving on to the 3 centre mids now. At left centre mid, we've got Popov. At right centre mid, we've got Milanov. And at, oh, sorry, and at centre centre mid, we have Grigoriev. We'll start at left centre mid with Popov. E Evelyn, Evelyn Popov, who plays for Kuban Krasnodar in the Russian League. We picked him up for 350 coins, 4-star weak foot, 3-star skill moves, and as you can see there, just like the goalkeeper, a fantastic array of well-rounded stats. 80 pace being his standout stat, but he does also have 75 dribbling, 75 shooting, and 73 passing. Moving on to the next best centre mid, we've got Milanov, who plays for CSK Moscow in the Russian League. We picked him up for 150 coins, 4-star weak foot, Two star skill moves and his standout stats being his 77 pace and his 69 dribbling, but it does also have at 67 passing, 66 shooting, and 63 heading. And the final of the three centre mids, moving on to Grigoriev, Bal Balagoy Grigoriev, I think that's how you pronounce it. Picked him up for 150 coins, three star weak foot, two star skill moves, medium, medium work rates. Great, he's the one that really does sit deep and help out play at the back. 
Uh, his standout stats being his 73 passing and his 72 dribbling, but it does also have a 68 heading, 65 defending, and 63 shooting. And finally, onto the striker. We all know who's coming. Big Dimitar Berbatov. Picked him up for 750 coins. Four-star skills. I'm pretty sure this is the only player in this team with four-star skills. Three-star weak foot. And Berbatov's standout stats being his 82 pace, uh, sorry, 82 passing and 82 dribbling. But it does also have 81 shooting and 80 heading. 66 pace isn't too bad. He, we just use him as sort of a target man in this team, really. Six foot two, he wins pretty much every header. Played 15, scored, scored 12, I think that is. So a really good conversion rate. So that's pretty much it, guys. If you did enjoy the video, give the video a thumbs up. Remember to comment down in the comment section below whether you want me to make a Canadian squad, a uh, Chilean squad, a Colombian squad, a Croatian squad, or a Czech Republic squad. Go and comment now. Give the video a thumbs up as well if you enjoyed it. And apart from that, I shall leave you guys with the right with the nice goals right now. Goodbye. So make some noise while you've got time. Take this poison for your mind. Who knows?